G'day, today we're going to have a look at level 17 in the Sapphire DLC of Frame Valley 2. This one is called Penguin Island. We have 15 minutes. We can't destroy any track tiles. We have to avoid train crashes. All right, so my first look at this one. So what do we got? We've got workers over here, a lot of workers, and then workers on this side. So the worker on this side doesn't need anything. It's just our workers on the right that want a whole bunch of things, all divisible by six. Weird annoyance that we start with um, five-seater trains. But we also don't have to build any um, train lines. It looks like that's already all done for us. Okay, so let's start off with some things that we need initially. So I can see that we're going to need wheat and oil are our starts of our two stacks. Let's go that way. Send him and we'll send him. Make sure this guy's going to end up down there. We'll make sure this guy's going to go that way. We're not destroying any tracks. Seems easy enough. It's just that we don't, we won't play uh, with attempting to, to make those changes. Obviously, the first thing that I think we want to do here is um, upgrade our um, trains to six seaters. That's a four there. We're going to have messes. I mean, it's basically just going to be that we're going to fill these two. We've got thirty-six. Those six guys in, in both. At the very least, they're going to need cows and food, so we're going to even need even more. So, we're going to need at least 36. So, absolutely, we can just keep shipping these guys. It costs us 25,000 to upgrade one of these. It would cost us 100,000 to upgrade all four. So, that's our initial sort of goal here. Uh, let's turn this guy and we'll send him over this way while that one just sort of fills up a bit more. The guy on the left is a much slower sort of uh, build of population. So he can sort of handle um, sort of sending more guys to the same one spot. Pretty quick turnover though. You can see that guy's already up to 18. So let's get more going up there. We'll just fill that out. Sixty-eight thousand. So apart from just the oil, what's going to need oil? It's going to be the polymers, I assume. Okay, so that's going to max out this guy up here, so then we can start to send these down this way. Uh, we can keep sending some over here. So our next step... So that's going to take him to 16, so we can send max, that'll hit him as a leap. I'm allowed to build more train lines, right? So I can do something like that. Okay, so next move is that maxes out is we're going to send uh, all of this wheat over to the cows. We are going to need 18 cows for the food as well as 18 cows for 18 cows. So all of the wheat that is currently in here um, could actually get sent over there. Now what we're going to do too is we can now afford to upgrade our trains to six seaters. So we'll just start with um, the one that we've got. But we'll wait till more arrive and then we'll just upgrade them as they go. Hopefully this guy doesn't charge into the back of that five seater. Now that does mean that 16 of this wheat has just moved. So it's a really weird number uh, that we're going to want to start to make guys manufacture. Already. We can keep going up too, we can go up to 7, which doesn't make much sense for the numbers that we're going to be working with. So we won't do anything. Uh, where's wood? Wood's over there, so a bit of a journey for this guy. Um, where do we want to send to? Let's just send 18 guys down into uh, the planks.
So now we can start to look to buy more trains too. So it should be 50. So 75,000 essentially will get us to a, a maxed out level of, um, of a, like a, well, not a maxed out, but like a six seater train. Okay. So that's that guy done there. Um, that guy could take another lot of workers. So let's do that. Take some more wheat as well. As this guy is just sort of gaining workers and we've got sort of the available people to move stuff around, I'm pretty happy to just say keep moving workers to where uh, we're going to eventually need workers either way. Is that cow is going to hit 18 pretty soon anyway? The rest of this wheat should be right to, to get in there and we won't lose any of it. And so that's our clean um, 36 cows that we're going to need in total for this one. Okay. One more of these guys over to the painters. As those guys get in, we can um, send these around to, to fill that out as well. And that means that we can get these guys to go work on getting another 36 wheat ready. Okay, so then we can send 18 cows over to the canned goods. This guy won't actually fit in there if that one doesn't get made first, so it's okay, he'll be right. Um, so that needs a break for a moment. Um, we then want to send workers around here to go do wood. And again, I think we're going to need, yeah, at least 36. We're definitely going to need more, actually, because we're going to need to make good. So we're going to need 48, I think. Uh, and again, there's no point just sitting there waiting for these guys to be ready. So we're going to send these ones all the way over to goods. What we can do as well, because we're just waiting, so I'm not sure where I'm going to have to send this oil, but we may as well get the oil being made, and I can just return the other 18 oil that's sitting on top of that pile. Let's get that guy out of the way at the same time. Okay, so we're getting close to being able to um, get more, um, like, purchase one of the two of these. We can now as well, actually. Let's buy that one. Send this last guy over to Wheat. Okay. Now... Next movements, what we want to do is we're going to take the 18 wheat that's here and we're going to move them into canned goods. At the same time, we'll send some workers up this way. We'll keep sending guys over to wood. I 
I think possibly we only need 18 of these um, steel plates. What we'll do as well is I'm going to move 18 of these over to um, electricity. So they can just sit there ready when they're, uh, they're needed. Okay, this wheat here can get sent back over here. And then these logs can get sent uh, over to the boards. I said I'm going to need more boards too, so as soon as they're across we can send uh, more guys around too. Um, so we now send these guys down. The, these workers will go to wood. These um, steel plates are going to go into the canned goods. Be careful I'm not going too fast with these because this guy otherwise won't be able to arrive. Let's just pause him for a second. Okay, so that's going to get them in there. The question I have is do I need electricity for polymers? I mean, I'm not getting any information at all about what, what polymers need at the moment. Um... We also need 18 coal back this way, so let's clear that out. Okay, then uh, we're going to need to get boards up to uh, this guy over here. Which is a weird sort of route because there's no connection. Sort of has allows us to go, um, or like around an easy way. So they have to go around this sort of like long way that way. Oh, can't destroy tractiles. I can't uh, think so. I mean, that's fine. What I can do is I can just stop him there, and then flick that around. He can go a shorter route to get up to where he's going. These two guys will send them around the original intended way. Okay, so then this guy is just a pay purchase. So we'll get them going that way. Okay, so we need 18 more boards as well. So we need to get first, get 18 logs down this way. And we also need to get some more guys up there. So that's enough that we... I need six more guys to be in logs, which is going to be what this fella's job is. Uh, and then we're going to send 18 guys down to the boards from up here. Then what we're going to do is send 18 guys over to electricity, because most of our electricity is going to go the wrong way. We'll just eat that, let him go that way, and... Send another train. All 
Alright, so we've got three minutes to get all of this stuff basically returned from, uh, from where we are. I think we've got everything made except for these boards. So, once these two guys get past, let's start to send things home. Now, in theory, I can actually upgrade all the trains at this point too, because um, it's, it's basically they've got the 18 or whatever that they require. We're just going to use this to make them move slightly faster. So, we're going to send wood straight across there. Upgrade that guy. So that's the wood that's going to get home. Uh, so behind them we can send some of these goods. Send canned goods behind that. A minute and a half to go. So we'll buy another train. Make sure we can keep moving. That's the cows, uh, so then it's just going to be one minute left. An eye on where this guy is in relation to everything else. Stop him there, start him up again. guys. Time left. It seems like those seven-seater trains may have been worth it. Done. Real time killed it. Fun's ordinary. Game time ordinary. Pretty standard for me. Uh, any questions or comments, feel free to check them below. And until next time, catch you later. See ya.